you won't see me reaching down and trying to touch the otters because they don't know me well enough. They, they would be more likely to bite me, so they're just not as familiar with me. Each of the otters is fed between 8 and 10 pounds of food a day, and that's from in, broken up into four feedings and then some in-between meal snacks. Otters need to eat a lot because that's partially how they stay warm. They have two things that keep them warm. One is that very, very dense fur, and I know Keith mentioned he's got a small piece of it that you can touch. That fur is so dense that it traps air next to their skin, and that layer of air between them and the water is actually what helps to keep them warm. The second thing is that they're burning up calories. They're eating the food and they're just burning those calories right up. Other marine mammals develop a layer of blubber or fat that helps to keep them warm, but these animals don't have that. They're, they are using every ounce of food that they eat um, in the process of staying warm. And their natural body temperature is about 101, even though they're living in, in water that's about 53 degrees. So they need to uh, eat a lot of food to keep that body temperature up. Well, the trainers just gave the finish signal, so that tells me they're done with the formal training. The otters are going to be given the remainder of their food and be allowed to just eat that at their leisure. I'll be joining Keith out on the mezzanine to answer any questions that you might have. But before I leave here, I want to remind you that um, although this time of year is not particularly fun for some of us, those of us that have to pay taxes never enjoy filling out those forms, but maybe you can turn that uh, frown upside down.